streaming service is going to replace the label? I don't know. I kind of feel that it feels like a bit of a monopoly, doesn't it? Taking record labels who have put so much time, money and infrastructure into music out of the equation. Musicians are there to make what they feel. The idea of a, a Spotify or an Apple or a Deezer or an Amazon Music or Google Play or whatever, signing an artist because they would fit really well in a playlist doesn't sit too well with me. And I don't think that'll work with traditional artists too. I think they'll be like going, hold on a second. I can't see that Spotify would be um, for in, entirely, at least for every music fan, seen as like the ultimate curator. Obviously they have, they are, and there are algorithms doing it as well as some people involved. Uh, but um, I think that when you, when you curate and you have a label and you're like part of that, that one particular label and you're associated with that label as an artist, that elevates you in a certain regard. And it also gives you a team of people, whether or not they're paying for you to be on their label or they're but they give you at least some support system, somebody to work with so that you're not completely alone. Because nobody can do this alone. No, I don't think streaming services will replace the role of the label. I mean, there's always been a lot of talk about our labels valid in the modern digital age of the music industry where it's so easy to release things DIY and where there are other players like streaming services. But I think labels have, if they're doing their job correctly, they have a very important job to do. Uh, they're experts in A&R, they're experts in marketing, they're experts in distribution, and those are things that you can't get elsewhere. And if you don't have those, um, those skills in your team, then I think you're going to really struggle to be a successful artist. I think streaming services could potentially replace labels. I mean, I think today it's like, it's anybody's game really, and it's about whoever can offer the best service for the artist. Um, so I think artists are becoming more intelligent in terms of of what they want from the industry, so whoever can offer them the best deal, they will they will win, really. I don't think it is possible for that to happen, provided the music companies do their job, which is build a genuine bridge between the creator and the consumer. And I think that means more than just putting a record out. I think it means engaging in multimedia levels all over the place and actually making a difference. Because simply put, if the, if the music business community, and in that I'd include publishers as well as labels, if they don't make a difference for the artist, if they don't make connections they couldn't otherwise have, creatively and commercially, there's simply no reason for them to exist, ultimately. They will go straight to market via the streaming services. I do not believe that is going to happen because I think there's a vibrant creative community within the record labels and publishers in the UK.